Music is an integral part of Hispanic culture. And as we continue to celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month, we are spotlighting a local performer and music teacher who is doing much more than teaching her students Latin lyrics and songs. Victoria Woodall went to Alma Music School. She wants to introduce you to Suzette Ortiz. Ama la tierra en que naciste. Ama la zona y nada más. It's not a job, it's not a chore that you're coming to class. You're coming to be with your friend, with your best friend. There's always that one teacher. She's the one. She's the one. Whose lessons and love for what they do never leave us. And for so many students and even faculty who've been fortunate to find Suzette Ortiz in their school, she is the one. Suzette did not know that being a Puerto Rican American, I was born on the island, but a lot of the things I didn't learn because we were living here in the continental U.S. And so as Suzette's teaching these beautiful Puerto Rican songs to the children, she's teaching them to me. As the artistic director at Amla Music School in North Philadelphia, she cultivates her students' Latin roots through rhythm and passion. She's described as a walking encyclopedia of Latin jazz, but some students call her something different. For the difference she's made in their lives. I have something they gave me when I retired that says, Mom, because not only I was their music teacher, I became their mother. To teach is a, is a gift. She's a performer, composer, and musical instructor. She plays more than five instruments. And at five years old, it would have been no surprise she's here behind the piano. But it was a surprise injury that brought her into teaching. I was 21, and I lost purpose. In, but I'm glad that happened because it taught me that really purpose in life means it's not about me. When we have this talent, it's for us to share, to try to make a difference. Beautiful. And CBS 3 will be celebrating National Hispanic Heritage Month through October 15th. Look for special continuing coverage on air and on CBS Philadelphia dot com.